Alright. Maybe if I was streaming from like something other than with the game this running. Is weird. I can't possibly have killed them all by myself. It feels like someone helped me. I can't remember. Say, Celine, were you singing when you found me? Singing? No, I wasn't. Uh, I feel like ash. I got this strange taste in my mouth. What about you, Myrna? How do you feel? I'm fine. Sorry for, you know. We both acted according to our conscience. You did what you felt was right, so did I. And you're much stronger than I thought. That's all. Did something happen? Ah, uh, your sister just showed me what's behind her veneer. And broke a few of my ribs in the process. I wouldn't have phrased it that way. Mission still is to survive, okay. Okay, after a little bit of grinding, let's uh, head on. Just got to turn the corner down here. You're late, Celine. Have you been slacking off? Oh, of course you have. Despite very clear instructions, you've been out wasting our precious time. Did you enjoy your little frolic? Did the pleasure of the afternoon sun on your cheeks make you forget about the daunting task that awaits us? You've turned up two hours later than my most dire predictions, and disappointed me yet again. But you haven't mentioned the worst part, Master. Which is? That despite all this, I'm still your favorite pupil. Damn right. I'm really happy to see you, Master. Well, the feeling's mutual. Oh, Myrna, who invited you? I'm here on my own business. And the young man with the thick aura of gloom must be your brother. Um, Darian? Aura of gloom, that's me right there. I'm sorry to interrupt this touching reunion. But I must ask for you to come with us, Alfarius. You! How long have you been following us? Since Hirosaur. I remember you, the two bounty hunters. We thought you spotted us, and decided to lose us in the pass of Olfara. But then I realized, you were just foolishly imprudent. Don't blame yourselves for not detecting us earlier. Derek and I are very good at what we do. You heard me, Alfarius. Surrender, and make everyone's lives a little easier. Oh, is this about the books I borrowed from the temple? Oh, I know they're one or two years overdue, uh, but I'm not quite finished reading them yet. Thank you for dropping by. Take care. Don't play dumb, Olfarius. It's not about the books. It's about you and the Alabaster Tablet. We know you hid it somewhere. Hmm. And if I refuse to give it to you? We'll proceed to beat you. Until you're nearly a lifeless pulp. Nearly lifeless? We're not monsters, Gavin. We don't kill people for such paltry sums. Four against two? You're biting off a bit more than you can chew, guys. Actually, three against two. I'm not done cooking, Darian. What? You brought them here, so it only seems fair that you're the one to get rid of them. You always did save the best news for last. This endless chatter is getting boring. Come on, Gavin. Do your thing. My thing? Do your stupid fancy soul tricks while you shield me from fatal blows. Oh, yeah. 
I see your future, and it is not bright. Always protect the caster. Yeah. He also upgraded the icons between the last time we played. As long as he's drawing hits, that's good. to get a crit get too cocky Get too cocky. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing personal. Okay, I think we're good now. Get too cocky. A prayer for your wayward soul. <laughs> Nothing personal. Fire seem to work, even though it's not showing up on the thing. Stuff is just messed up because you don't have fire now. Have to Nothing check that. personal.
Nothing personal. There we go. Also, while we're on the screen, it's this one over here. Numbered. Let's pull out, Derek. I'm holding you responsible for this debacle, Gavin. Where's he? Where's he at? Why is there two wolves there? All right, after that, I'm going to go save. Oh, now we have to go all the way in? Like, what happened to Aphareus? But at least we got our cat back. My master is over there. Let's go and see him. Yeah, he was right here. Where did he why did he run away, Celine? spread as far as the Pass of Alfara. The consort is doing everything in its power to limit the spread, but... Hmm. They won't be able to keep it contained forever. If we don't do something soon, Harrion is lost. Then let's not waste any more time and discuss the reason we're all here. I have found a resurgent. A... resurgent. <sighs> What's a resurgent? Master, are you sure? Are you certain it was a resurgence? I'll let you be the judge. You were standing right in front of me and presented all the signs of fluxion. Fluxion? Okay, all right. But fluxion is no guarantee on its own. You know that as well as I do. Hey, what's a resurgence? He spoke to me. He spoke to you. He spoke to you? You're telling me he showed all the signs of fluxion and was still speaking? Master, were you wearing your glasses when you examined him? Are you sure about this? A perfect case, Celine. We have it. Yes, what do we have exactly? A resurgent. Someone who survived the corrosion. Uh, even I know what a resurgent is, Darian. <sighs> so this... A resurgent, or whatever you call it, is someone who has survived the corrosion? How did they do that? He refused to answer my questions. Your first task will be to get it out of him. So there's someone who has survived the corrosion that the Sanctorium hasn't snapped up for research. I find that hard to believe. Oh, you'll understand everything when you get there. Or you could just answer my questions now. We don't know enough yet. We don't have time to waste on suppositions and speculation. Get to Tyre Caleb, the city of the Techno Mages, and ask for Taranis. She will tell you where to find the resurgent. Okay. Tyre Caleb and Taranis. Got it. Well, now that we have a plan, I'll leave you guys to reminisce about the old days. I'm gonna go hit the sack. Good night, guys. Good night, Darian. And I will too. Dealing with these two has proved more exhausting than I could ever have imagined.
And that's what we've been doing, until we finally found you. Jackal, huh? Well, that was a good call, Selim. And you. What have you been doing? Causing trouble again? Committing heresy upon heresy, Selim. All thanks to you. Please. You were a thorn in the Sanctorian side long before I showed up. So, did you find it? Nearly. The alabaster tablet was the only piece missing. By the next time we see each other, I'll have pinpointed its location. Will we be able to talk to the gods? Well, that will depend on you. Does your brother know of your destiny? No. He has too much on his mind right now. Our mother, the war. I think it's too soon for that kind of conversation. You know best. Celine, I swore to myself that I wouldn't bother you with my doubts. So I'm telling you again, leave the Sanctorium. Not this again. I'm serious. They don't deserve you. And you, you deserve better. The Sanctorium is strayed from its path. It used to serve the gods, now it only serves itself. That is precisely why we must do this now, today. You won't find happiness there, Selene. It's not happiness I seek. It's truth. I've made up my mind. You know what that means. And this is the most important decision I've ever made. What if it leads you to the pyre? Then I will face the pyre. <sighs> I was afraid you'd say that. And I'll take a bucket. What? I knew from the start there was something off about you. I just couldn't figure out what it was. Then, traveling with you, I caught a hint. A faint scent of something. Archolite oil. You're no mere soul searcher, are you, Myrna? I underestimated you. And now we'll both pay the price of my foolishness. Let's end this, quickly! Why do you want to kill me, Myrna? Once again, you're not making any sense! Hmm. Finish this off and then I can heal.
I'm wounded. She got away. Why? Why did she do that? What happened? Our friend, the Soul Searcher, tried to kill me, and she used Arcolite machines to do her bidding. Oh, Mana? But why? Alfarius, you're the one who trusted Myrna in the first place. You better have an explanation. I didn't know she used Arcolite war machines. Mena is... was a good friend. On several occasions, she went out of her way to help me. Under her cover as a soul searcher, she worked as an informant, a, a broker. We traded information on a regular basis, and she always proved trustworthy. Yeah, until now. I'm sorry, Darian. My carelessness nearly cost you your life. And now we'll never know why she attacked me. Okay. Where's it almost to go? All the way up there. Okay. I did see. We camped over there. Yeah. All right, well, let's make this long, long run. Onward to Tyr Kalem. Let's stay alert. Oh, yes. I almost forgot. Myrna, she might be there too. I still don't understand why she would want to kill me. I can't understand it either. It's like she thought you were meant to die in the Pass of Ulfara and wanted to set things right? It does feel like that. Maybe she had a vision that I would die there? Maybe she's a perfectionist and just wanted to make sure all her predictions came true. You're joking, right? You know very well what I think of Soul Searchers. Let's check out this town. Just crafting tables. More side quests. stuff to buy for crafting. Okay, let's check the piers. Then we might be moving on. Crafting stations.
Okay. Yeah, this is just a little pit stop town, it feels like. What do we got? So I need pants for him. Five, six. The body. Don't like that the icons aren't for what slot they're for. But let's just grab one of everything. And we'll feel we'll figure out what is worth equipping. Lose a haste and speed for one defense or two defense there. Yeah, we're probably going to keep the one we got. Want that incantation speed? Yeah, we're kind of good, I think. Skip through these. Come on. So they feel like they get like no EXP. All right, let's head on back out. Okay. Well, that's a crash thing. Is it a ship or is it just some barrels? Force this way. Celine, be careful. This one is no pushover. We should probably be able to distract it. On my signal, send some electricity on a pylon.
I will commend your soul to the gods. I have an idea. I want to see if what he does. A prayer for your wayward soul. Okay, so it is doing numbers, you're just not seeing them on screen. Push through. Celine, call some thunder on a pylon. Direct hit to its cooling system. She's gonna explode, Celine. Don't stay in. Oh, there wasn't. No cutscene after that. Okay. And a ship. <laughs> Far away to go.
Just another zone. What if that means we can teleport back to the rest of the world now? Since technically we could go through that area. Did you know that techno mages hate being called that? They prefer to be called ciphers. Well, if they don't want to be called that, maybe they should stop dabbling in magic and technology. Sounds like you don't like them much. It's not that. It's just that they live in these giant archolite wrecks. Oh. Is it dangerous? Misfiring cannons, war machines, and bombs lying around everywhere. Oh boy, 